Bharat uh, Express train uh, as we head from Delhi to Varanasi, sitting in the executive class and a look at the features. You of course have uh, diffused lights over here. You have uh, panels on top where you can uh, put your luggage. Uh, these are the uh, these are the seats that are comfortable. They allow you to recline yourself a little bit. Uh, allow you to push the seat back and forth. But the most unique feature of this uh, executive class is that it allows you to turn your chair. Uh, to a total of 180 degrees. Probably you might want to just uh, look uh, look at the scenery outside and probably just place it at this angle or really decide uh, to go 180 uh, degrees. Uh, if you go 180 degrees, then uh, you are able to open uh, your you are able to open uh, this uh, this uh, table over here so that you can place your food uh, over here and eat uh, and enjoy yourself and then probably look at turning around. Now this uh, comes in at a cost of uh, 3,310 rupees which is of course a one way journey. Uh, uh, the, the, the train uh, which uh, claims to be uh, India's first semi-bullet train has of course been assembled in India. It is uh, a brand made in India, uh, make in India that the Prime Minister and the government has constantly been speaking about. Uh, uh, interestingly, the train opens for public booking from the 17th uh, of uh, uh, February and our sources are telling us that it's already 99% booking has already been uh, completed. Uh, this train was flagged off by Prime Minister Narendra Modi a short while ago uh, from Delhi. What do you expect? Uh, uh, you know, I think it's a matter of pride for each and every citizen of India that our engineers, our own young boys and girls, have designed this train, have manufactured this train in a very short period of time and taken us into that elite club of countries which used to make train sets. As you have experienced, it's a very modern train, very comfortable, high speed. In fact, its capability is much more. Now we have to expand the rail infrastructure, the tracks, the fencing and make it go up to 180 kilometers. We are already working at overnighters with sleeper coaches. We are now looking at the next level of going up to 250 kilometers. India is going to become the provider of technology and equipment to the whole world because the cost at which we will supply, nobody in the world can match. Our engineering prowess, nobody in the world can match. And that's a tribute to young India, to new India. Amazing journey, of course, it's a, it's a unique experience. You can see that people, uh, the speed, uh, in fact, which is clocking at 130 kilometers an hour, uh, that's what it, what it brings in. It brings in a unique experience. Uh, the, 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 the chair car uh, category is, uh, is uh, available at a cost of 1760 rupees. There are, of course, 16 coaches in this train, out of which uh, uh, two are executive and the rest are, uh, are the chair cars. The chair cars have uh, a very limited uh, space in terms of whether you can move back or forth uh, but uh, people are excited there were a lot of people there at the railway station uh, where the Prime Minister was flagging it off uh, we'll keep bringing you more and more details as we uh, take you on this journey from Delhi to Varanasi